Hello SpaceX! My name is Daniel Hastings. I'm an aerospace engineering student at Iowa State University. The aim of this video is to showcase my skills, passions, abilities, and experience, and I hope that you will be as convinced as I am that I would be a perfect fit at SpaceX. What you do at SpaceX is the coolest thing in the world, and it's exactly what I want to be doing when I enter the industry. I know you get a lot of intern applications, but in this video I would like to show what sets me apart. What pushed me into the field of space exploration in the first place was model rocketry. I used to build crazy little rockets out of duct tape as a kid, uh, but they never seemed to fly straight. So I was motivated to borrow a book from the library on the subject. I learned about static stability. Once my first rocket soared out of sight, I was hooked for life. Since then, I have done many projects in rocketry and have won several awards for my work. Every year I used to submit an aerospace project in 4-H and on several occasions won purple award at the state level. In high school I led the Andover rocket team in Team America Rocketry Challenge which was a wonderful experience working on a team. Now I am into high power rocketry and have earned my level 2 certification. This here is my current project. It's a minimum diameter, all fiberglass, hand laid composite rocket that flies on a J motor. And the idea is to break Mach 2, provided the rocket doesn't break first. I am a self directed learner, which stems in part from my background in homeschool. Since Iowa State doesn't have a strong program in specifically rocket propulsion, I have undertaken extensive independent study on the subject as evidenced by my library. One of my favorites, rocket propulsion elements, I love so much that I've started um, a YouTube series on, on the subject in order to help educate other people who are coming up behind me. Um, another one that I love is uh, Fundamentals of Astrodynamics, which is um, used in two classes that I'll be taking, and I'm getting a head start now, and I'm loving the subject. And then, my absolute favorite, Spacecraft Environment Interactions. You will notice that it is authored by one Daniel Hastings. This is purely a coincidence, and I think it's hilarious, but I love the book. My love for space exploration and rocketry found its way to the Iowa State Space Society, which is a chapter of the National SEDS organization, Students for the Exploration and Development of Space. This past year, I was the projects chair and helped club members with rocketry projects. The vision for ISSS is to cultivate interest in space exploration from diverse backgrounds and majors, not just aerospace engineers. ISSS has been a great leadership experience for me, and working and socializing with its diverse members has been a wonderful way to learn and grow. During my freshman year at Iowa State University, I wanted to take my love for rocketry to the next level. I found that opportunity through University Student Launch Initiative, a NASA competition for universities across the country to design, build, and fly a high-power rocket and scientific or engineering payload to an altitude of one mile. During one of the first meetings, I had the option of working on the rocket team or the payload team, and I decided to branch out and work on the payload. This took me way outside of my comfort zone, but it was a fantastic idea because I learned many new skills, specifically about electronics prototyping, programming in C, and feedback and controls. The payload we built was a controlled descent vehicle that used a parafoil recovery on a servo to autonomously correct its flight path to guide it to a target landing zone after the scale of a skydiver. The second year, I was a co-leader of the Iowa State team. I learned how to manage a team working on multifaceted design objectives. Because of my electronics experience from the previous year, I was able to guide the payload team into further complicated design objectives. Expanding on the previous year's concept, we used a quad rotor design with an active feedback stabilization flight computer in order to provide a steady platform for an onboard controllable camera. The 
was to create a user-friendly eye in the sky, useful for military tactical situations, rescue operations, and aerial photography. While the competition launch suffered an unfortunate altimeter malfunction that terminated the flight early, the overall project was a success, as demonstrated by multiple test flights. During the project, I learned patience and perseverance in the face of some pretty daunting obstacles. Because of my abilities and interests in rocket propulsion, electronics, and space exploration, and my strong interpersonal skills, I hope that you will consider me for an internship at SpaceX this fall. Thank you for watching!